For this session, we're gonna be doing some fitness warm-ups working on our legs. Now, some of the muscles in your legs, these muscles at the front are called your quadricep muscles. We have hamstring muscles at the back of your legs. And your calf muscles down here are also known as your gastrocnemius muscles. So we're gonna do each exercise for 30 seconds. We're gonna start with some step and kicks. For step and kicks, you're gonna step and kick your opposite foot to your opposite hand. And we're working on our hamstrings. So try and swing all the way through as high as you can. Switching legs each time. Okay, next one we're gonna do wide toe touches. We're gonna start nice and wide and we're gonna touch right hand to our left foot and then we're going to switch. 30 seconds off we go. Staying nice and low, nice and wide. Keeping your legs straight. You might feel this in the inside of your legs and also in your hamstrings. Keep your legs wide, nice straight arms twisting from side to side. Okay, next one we're gonna do heel butt kicks. So for this one, just gonna bring your heel up to touch your butt and bring it back down and switch feet. Try and stay upright. You should feel a good stretch in your quadricep muscles. Try and stay balanced. Touching your heel to your butt. Fantastic. Okay, now we're kind of warmed up. Now we're gonna do a little bit of fitness. First up, we're gonna do airplane lunges. You're gonna put your arms out nice and wide. Step forward and lunge with one foot. Come back up and then step forward with the other foot. Okay, so you're bending that knee at the front and bending that leg at the back. This is working on our quadricep muscles. Staying nice and upright. Okay, next one we're gonna do our hamstring kicks. So this time, you're gonna bring your knee up, you're gonna hug it in, and you're gonna kick forward and down, and then bring the next leg in. So bring that knee up, hug it, and kick. Try and kick out nice and straight, as high as you can. Is working on our hamstrings. You should feel them getting a good stretch. Okay, next one we're gonna do slalom jumps. You're gonna put your feet together and you're just gonna jump from side to side and twist your hips at the same time. If you're twisting your hips, you can see my knees are together, my feet are together. Just side to side, left and right. This is working our calf muscles, our gastrocnemius muscles. Excellent. Next one, we're gonna do wide and narrow. We're gonna jump wide and together. Off you go. Nice and straight legs when you go ride, and straight legs when you come narrow. You should really feel this on your calves. And hold it there. Hogo jumps. This is a fun one. You're gonna put hands on your hips and you're gonna jump up as high as you can. Trying to keep your legs straight, you're just using your toes. 
to jump up using your calf muscles. You know, like a pogo stick. We're not bending our knees. You're just staying straight. Like a pogo stick. And then to finish off, we're gonna do some calf raises. Again, hands on your hips. You're just gonna slowly come up on one foot and back down. You're gonna try and go onto your tiptoes. Just try and get as high as you can on your tiptoes and come back down. Switching feet each time. And that's it for today's session. See you next time. If you and your elementary class are enjoying these lessons, make sure you check out my lesson plans in the links below. I've got loads of fitness ideas, loads of games, loads of sport specific drills and ideas. Everything you need to teach game changing sport at your school. So check them out and I'll see you next time.